as you can see here we have something that we've been without for a few years uh, we have the getter back lure retriever and this is the lure retriever that I have used forever you want to get your baits back this thing right here will do it it don't matter if it's a jig if it's a Carolina rig if it's a crane bait if it's Alabama rig it'll get it back and yeah, I finally talked Lou's in to producing this again and like I say uh, you may remember one time this used to be blue so now we got the yellow loose color but this thing is real unique it slides on your line it goes up and down and the whole secret to this lure retriever is lightweight so it doesn't break your line it's coated so it won't tear your bait up but it all works on balance when this hits the lip of your bait it tilts just like this and that is the big key it either knocks it loose or it can catches the hooks and you can pull it free. It comes with a 28 foot nylon cord. Uh, there are several ways you can do it. You can put it on your anchor end, you can put it on a dog leash, and it makes it even more convenient. But man, you want something that will save your lure and will pay for itself. Probably two baits will pay for it. So uh, this depends. Sometimes one bait will pay for it. But man, what a, what an asset to have. And no matter how deep it is, you know, you got a 28 foot cord, but this thing will get it loose in any depth. So remember, it, it's sort of, this lure retriever is all in how you work it. You can drop it down on it, but really the best thing is, and let me grab my rod and reel here, is when you slide it on, and I'm going to show you how to slide this on real easily. I'm going to drop this cord, but it actually, put your line right here, and I got it upside down, but anyway, um, like so, and it goes down. But see when it hits, see what it does? It will either punch it loose or catch the hooks. And the thing about this is a lot of times if you will let it down on your lure, and if it doesn't knock it loose as soon as it touches it, take your rod tip and move it up and down, like so. And what that does, it makes it kick, just like that and it will get it 99.9% .9 of the time it's going to get it loose so there again you know something innovative uh, we've actually improved this model a little bit with a good heavy coating on it so it won't like I say it won't tear your your baits up and it'll get it loose so anyway look for look at it at your favorite loose dealer if you'll notice you know, this thing has a little ring on it, and what you do is you lay it on your line just like that, and it's going to slide just like so, and that's how easy it, it goes on, and as you let it down, see how it went up under the log? I mean, I am up under the log, look at there. It'll get it every time. I mean, it's very, very simple to work. It's all on how it's balanced because as you can see right there, it's tilted. You know, when this lure retriever, when the getter back lure retriever hits the lip of your bait, that's what it does. It kicks it and it pushes it loose. Probably eight out of 10 times, as soon as it touches it, it will knock it loose. If it doesn't, take your rod tip and move it up and down with your lure retriever on a slack line.